my name is Jason Olson, the owner operator of the Pleasant Hill Grocery Outlet. And today I'm going to give you a little sneak peek and a little taste of what Jason's all about. One thing about being a small business owner is it's a lot of work. We're here seven days a week working and slaving away. But one fun part of my job is that I work in my own wine department. So today I'm going to go over a variety of different wines, introduce to you a new program that we've started called WOW, Wines of the Week. And it is a WOW. So I'm going to go over six wines today, three red and three white. Now, typically when you come into the store, I'm going to have my pick six barrel set up that's going to give you tasting notes, my stamp of approval on each and every one of these wines. There's going to be six reds on one side of the form, six whites on the other. So we're going to get started in a minute, but let me tell you a little bit about myself first. For one thing, I'm not a great wine connoisseur. I'm an everyday Jason kind of guy. I live here in, in Pleasant Hill, have a family of three. We work hard every day. So what I'm going to describe to you is basically my lingo. I don't know all the big pronunciations and the fancy words, so you might have to bear with me a little bit, but I want to give you a true taste of what we sell here at the Pleasant Hill Grocery Outlet. Now, if you go to other grocery outlets, chances are you're going to find a lot of these same wines. So if I run out here, you might want to drive across town to one of my sister stores and pick up some other ones. However, if you like one of these wines, there's a good chance that it's here today and gone tomorrow. So that by the time you're watching this fun and exciting video of me, these wines could already be gone. All right, now with that being said, are you ready to be wowed? Because we're going to start off with six great wines. The first wine I have today is EOS French Connection. Now, this is personally one of my favorite wines that we've had in the store. Last month alone, we sold uh, 212 cases of this. We depleted the supply from the winery, so there's only 20 cases as of today at the winery left. We sell this for $4.99. Other places sell it for at least $12.99 plus, and if you go to the winery, it's $25 a barrel. So this is a hot deal. It's a fantastic wine, one of my favorites. It's a blend, it's California, Paso Robles, awesome. The next wine is another fantastic red. This is called Arrowhead Mountain Vineyards. Now this is an interesting wine. This is not for the weak at heart. This wine is big, it's hot as I would say. It's 15.2 alcohol, has a little bit of sediment in the bottle. It's a 2006, but it's a fantastic wine. Now to me, what I get from it is I get a little pepper and I like that. The interesting part of this wine and why you're getting that pepper is because it's a Zinfandel blend. It's half Zinfandel, half Syrah. So on most Zinfandels, you have that jammy end of the spectrum or the peppery. This is definitely on the peppery end. It's $2.99 today. The winery selling it for $41.30, $41.30 a bottle. Kind of crazy. Look it up. Find it yourself. You don't have to trust me, but you should. I have a very limited quantity of this, so come in today and try it out. It's fantastic. Another great red. Now, folks, I love reds. I'm more of a red drinker than a white drinker. I do my best with the whites, but I really get passionate about these reds. This one I stumbled across. I believe it's Parakita. I don't know. Again, I can't speak all these fancy words, but this is a Portugal wine. It's a blend of three different grapes from the area that I can't pronounce, but it's fantastic. It's a big, bold wine, has hints of oak, and again, a little on the peppery side. Again, that's my style. Might not be for everybody, but it's $6.99. Elsewhere, $9.99 plus. It's a fantastic wine, and I only have about a case of this left. Let's get into the whites. Okay, I'm going to try to be real excited here, but I don't drink as many whites, but I like them. You're pouring, I'm drinking. This is Luna Pinot Grigio from Napa Valley. This wine's a little interesting. Chilled cold. It's a Pinot Grigio, so you're going to have a little bit of grapefruit, going to have a little bit of other citrus and lemon. It's great chilled on a nice hot day. It's great just for drinking. You can pair it with any meal. It's $4.99. Elsewhere, you're going to find it for about $11.99 plus. A great white wine. Let's do another white because whites are exciting. This one actually I'm very excited about. This is Earthstone Chardonnay. Now to me, even though it's a Chardonnay, it drinks a little bit more like a, like a, like a Sauvignon Blanc. It has a lot of pear to it. It has a little bit of lemon to it, has a little skosh of oak, skosh, there's a fancy word, has a little bit of oak in it, um, but I don't get the butter at all. So if you like a rumbauer or the buttery end of the spectrum, come see me and I'll help you find something like that. But this is a great summertime wine. It's a great value. It's $4.99. Elsewhere, you're going to find it for $12.99 plus. So for those Chardonnay lovers that like a little bit of fruit, come see me. This is a great one. And our last white is Napa Landing White Sauvignon Blanc. This has been our best seller. Again, these kind of start sounding alike, um, but this one has a little bit of lemongrass to it, 
whatever that is, but it's a little lemony, also has a little bit of mango to it. So a good, it's a great summertime wine, chilled cold. It's from Napa Valley. Again, it's $4.99, elsewhere $12.99 plus. So what's gonna happen, you're gonna come into my store, chances are you're gonna see me, because I work seven days a week, but it's really not a job, it's a lifestyle, and I love it, and I'm passionate about wine. You can come into my wine department, see my wine barrel, look for the wows. Wine of the week, it is a wow. Not only because it's a wine of the week, but it's just a wow price. How's Grocery Outlet get these prices? Is this bad wine? Has it been stored wrong, too hot, boiled, cooked? No, not at all. There's several different reasons we get these great wine values. For one thing, as you know, shopping in our store, because we got it all, we shop for opportunistic buys. We have a team of three great buyers out of our parent company, Berkeley Grocery Outlet. They're scouring the globe to find these deals. A lot of times, wineries are doing secondary labels. They might have too much juice. They might be pushing out product that they have in their tasting rooms at the wineries to bring in fresh stuff. So we get it at a phenomenal price, and we pass that price right on to you. There's nothing wrong with these wines. They're fantastic. Come see me. We guarantee everything 100%. We're not a wine tasting, but come on in. If you're not happy with something, come back and see me because I want to make sure you're happy with what you get here. 100% money-back guarantee. So come in and see us. Look for the six pick. You're going to see the wow signs. If there's anything left on the shelf, grab it quick. Because again, remember, today it's here. Could be gone tomorrow. We'll have great tasting notes for you. And again, they're layman terms because that's just how it is. If you're looking for all the fancy words, I can try to accommodate you. We can go back to the office and look on the internet. But it's pretty much down to earth here at the Pleasant Hill Grocery Outlet. So come on in and see us. I look forward to seeing you in the store and hope to talk to you real soon. Thanks and have a wonderful day. Wow. Grocery Outlet Bargain Market.